All right, so the whole Eminem thing, what happened to him, knowing deep down that that's just not the same, the same person. Um, I really, really, really knew about this guy. Like my little brother used to listen to him when he was with D12 back when they were in Detroit, back when nobody knew about him. Um, he wasn't, he was, when he got famous, he was listening to his old stuff with D12. Um, it wasn't like he was listening to it before, you know, uh, the Slim Shady LP or whatever, but, um, anyways, so I really, really had a good idea who this guy was. And I guess one album, I guess it was Recovery or something um man he really just he fucking it was it just wasn't him and i remember on the cd before that uh he had a song where he was he was like talking to the devil and it was uh it was very very revealing okay um I think he uh, he made some type of deal with the devil, it seems like. And, you know, kind of a, it, it's a soul thing. All right, let's say we take you, let's, let's say we take you or um, some, some wonderful, great person, um, you know, with a great heart. Uh, if those people even exist anymore, you take somebody like that and then all of a sudden they just turn evil and they start doing sick, disgusting shit. They're going to look different. Um, people are saying Eminem got cloned. I, I don't know. I, it, I think it could be a soul thing. Um, I think maybe just some black spirit just crept down inside of him and it, it could be the same shell it could be the same uh quote unquote person but he's been so overtaken by whatever demon or alien or say satanic force um you know, it's it's a soul thing, really. So, like I said, you take some beautiful person, you have them do just all types of sick, disgusting shit, and they become, you know, sick and disgusting in the mind. They're they're just gonna look different. You know, you take a look around at these people out here, and um, you can tell, you know, that, that their minds was going on inside. Their minds is. Uh, reflected pretty much on how they look on the outside a lot of the times. Um, a lot of these people are very easy to judge. A lot of these despicable people so um, are despicable to behold at least. So anyways, yeah, I think it's uh, I, I just don't know if it was if it was another if it's another life form. You know, but his soul is certainly, you know, I guess he used to have soul in his music and his um, interviews or whatever. Now he's just, I don't know, man. When you make those deals, uh, the shit just... Just, it's a deal for your soul. I mean, your soul is gone, so what's left? And this motherfucker has some, like, really black, dark eyes now, even though he had very blue eyes before. Almost like a fucking Viking, this guy. And now, uh, yeah, I mean, I guess they're still kind of blue-colored, but, uh, it, yeah, it looks like some black not being racist, but just some black entity like crept inside of him and fucking took over. And, you know, the boundaries of uh, the physical world, like I said, when you mix in, you know, the 
the spiritual world. Like you could have a beautiful person turn hideous just from doing a lot of uh, sick demonic shit. I think they could just their look would change. Um, and you know, not that Eminem was sacrificing babies or anything like that, but. Um, I mean, he, he might've, yeah, he might've made a deal with the devil and, uh, the devil just really, really stuck it to him extra hard. Maybe that's, he just seems like the worst that I've seen, but you know, you've got, uh, you've got, what's his name too. You've got, um, Paul McCartney from the Beatles, you know, and I already made a video talking about what I think happened to him. He got replaced by uh, the Demon Ball, but I don't know. You know, I think he's. Uh, I think Paul McCartney is also Lane Staley. Um, but I just, I, I don't know. I mean, you know, only God knows, and maybe Satan too. Um, powerful demons, but yeah, I don't really. I don't really know for sure what's going on. It's just my theory on it. It's a, basically a, a Mandela effect of the soul, you know. Um, and this is why Jesus Christ's words can't be uh, changed too much by the Mandela effect because um, his soul was, yeah, it was supremely powerful, so... Uh, you know, um, any, any weakness in your soul, man, the devil's going to really, uh, is going to really, really go for him. Whatever Eminem's was, uh, he was exploited for it. I think, you know, I think it was on some shit like that on some, um, Faustian bargain, which a lot of musicians, Seemed to maybe done a lot of artists. Picasso, he seems to have done it. Um, it's probably a huge list that you could pull out. But uh, anyways, that's the video.